This is one insanely fast SSD. I, I just, I can't even comprehend how awesome it is. So uh, feel free to stick around for the review. <laughs> Check out our website at techteamgb.co.uk for more info on both this and many other products, and also up-to-date news on all things tech. Stick around for this awesome video. Last year I took a look at the 850 EVO M.2 drive, and that was basically a SATA drive in an M.2 form factor. Now this one, the 950 Pro, is a serious, full-on NVMe 32 gigabit per second SSD. It is insanely fast and just incredibly amazing. It, it, I personally really like the look of it actually with obviously the black PCB, the very kind of intricate detail on resistors and tr uh, sort of line traces and stuff, um, and obviously the uh, Samsung VNAND 950 Pro sticker definitely makes it look pretty cool. Now I'm testing the 512 gig version and it's uh, it's insane. Seriously, this, this drive is uh, just incredibly fast. There is nothing to compare it to uh, besides a RAM disk, which is why I'm using a RAM disk in the uh, in the tests. To install it, basically install it like sewed in memory in a laptop, just put it in at a slight angle, make sure it's all the way in the slot, push it down and then put the screw in. Now in terms of real world testing, I tried copying the AMD uh, kind of uh, Crimson driver, the pre-release one, which was about 700 meg, and it copied faster than Windows could make the, like create the copier window. I also copied an extra couple gig worth of footage uh, to a RAM disk and back again, and um, yeah, I got 1.5, basically 1.5 gigabytes per second minimum, gigabytes Per second, that's insane. Also, the Crystal Disk Mark scores: the maximum was 2.5 gigabits per second, gigabytes per second read, and 1.5 gigabytes per second write, which is just insane and so awesome. I just, I want one so badly. I wish this was mine. <laughs> Now because there's technically so little to show with this product, um, this is probably going to be a relatively short video, but um, I just want to kind of give you my thoughts on the SSD uh, while I have it. Uh, and my main thought is, wow, it's fast. Seriously, this thing, like when I was doing data transfers just to see, uh, I had a RAM disk set up because that's pretty much the only thing that will be fast enough to legitimately copy and not be the bottleneck. Um, it was insanely fast. I was getting more than a gigabyte a second minimum. That like one gigabyte per second was the minimum. Um, gigabyte as well. Please note, gigabyte per second. It's just insane. Um, obviously, at 512 gig is fantastic uh, for you know some Steam games. Obviously, being your boot SSD and some other files as well. So it's a I would say it's a perfect size for where it is. And I was interested to see that the fact that the other side of the, the PCB is blank, so it looks like it wouldn't be too hard for them to fit another 512 gig worth of uh, chips on there to be able to make it something like a one terabyte uh, SSD. I wonder if that's going to be the 960 Pro, I wonder. Hmm. It'd definitely be pretty awesome. But uh, anyway, um, yeah, it's just, it's so fast, uh, I can't even comprehend. Um, if you are going to be, you know, a, a baller, as Linus would say, and um, can it go for a killer rig with 980 Ti's like um, like the one in there? Um, then you know you you can definitely uh, check one of these out. I, I would seriously recommend it. And the fact that it's so small, obviously no cables are needed or anything. It's literally just a case of shoving it into your motherboard, and you know it works fine. Um, is is something that's pretty awesome, and I'm really pretty pretty impressed by it. Um, in terms of scoring, it's going to be a four for five money because while it is. Uh, quite expensive at the point of filming, it is incredibly awesome and that kind of offsets it a little bit. Um, in terms of uh, price, or uh, sorry, uh, performance and functionality, it is awesome and it has to get a 5. Obviously the Samsung Magician software I've been talking about for the last kind of, well, all of the Samsung SSD reviews um, is still pretty great, it's still nice to be able to check the smart readings and stuff like that to make sure it's all still healthy and working. Um, and yes, yeah, style is going to be a 5. Besides the fact that it's upside down on the MSI board I was checking it out in, it definitely looks awesome and kind of, I don't know, professionally awesome, professionally cool. Uh, by the way, I realise I say the word awesome too much. I'm sorry, I can't help it. I am trying to fix it. Um, yeah. Anyway, um, in terms of Texture Movie Score, it's going to get a 5 and it's going to get the gold award as well because hot damn it's good. Um, I've, I've got no other words for that. It's just, it's amazing. It's, it's really cool. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you uh, did, feel free to like. If you didn't, feel free to dislike, but let me know what you thought in the comments down below. Um, and also, as a quick note, as a friendly reminder, 
if you watch videos on Vesso, including people like Linus and Hardware Canucks, check me out there because these videos are on Vesso. If you're on YouTube, you won't really need to know that they are. If you don't have a Vesso account, don't worry about it. All the videos will still be here. But if you are on Vesso, hello. Um, and uh, yeah, feel free to leave a comment. Um, but if you have a Vesso account, feel free to check out these videos a week early on there too. So um, yeah, I guess that's it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you all in the next video.